fly like Foga. Yeah, pull up in a beam. Too much to clean your toilet. Aye, don't foster. Serious in uh, A big time player. Trip to big in Ganja. Aye. Oh, do I like Bashita? Ask my sister. My music travel no visa. Oh, yeah, ask your sister. She never said she not know me. You feel the beat, you go down low. She never said she not know me. You feel the beat, you go down low. Now that's how you start a grand finale of this magnitude. I am VJ Adams. Welcome to the grand finale of the Nine Jasper Italian Horn Season 2. Super excited on every level. The last nine weeks have been a roller coaster ride of emotions, laughter, tears, and goosebumps, but we'll wrap it all up in grand style for you tonight. Now the votes are in, but beyond the votes all week long, uh, the contestants will perform on the stage, and the judges have 40% take in deciding who will emerge the overall winner. Now, what we're talking about here is 7 million naira in cool cash for the grand prize. All expense paid trip to Dubai and Kenya. It doesn't get any bigger than this. Plus, this, without a doubt, is a life-changing experience. Without further ado, let's get the show cracking. I am VJ Adams, and this is the Night Jazz Spirit Talent Horn Season 2 Grand Finale. On the first ever season of the Night Jasper Talent Hunt, singer Constance was unanimously declared a winner. And now the quest of finding the season's winner continues with your constant and unrelenting voting via the DTH app. Now more than ever, you will be required to vote during the course of the live shows and the lines will be open shortly after the first set of performances for tonight. Stay tuned for the next 15 minutes to ensure that you vote your most preferred talents to emerge as the winner for this season. Let's bring out your judges, get ready. Aikyo Bonna! Aikyo Bonna! Yes, that's the sound of a finale, I love it. The way he's dressed, you can tell he's, he's angry, he means business. Dr. Sid! <laughs> means business, my man. Illegal Rose! Come on. Yes. I just had to. Last but not the least. Everybody say, I believe I can fly. In the air door. Yes. All right, judges, quickly. IK, finale, it's game time, it's show time. How excited are you? Uh, it's been a, a long 10 weeks, and uh, finally we're here. I, I really can't tell how it's going to end, but um, I'm really excited that we're at this point, and today we can crown a winner, finally. Let's go, finally. Iniedo, quickly, final thoughts, it's game time. Yes, the D-Day is here, so we're all excited. I mean, blow me away, as usual. As usual, let's go. Lico Rose, you I'm pumped? Uh, yeah, I'm pumped at the same time. I'm kind of, you know, no. I'm having missed finish right now. Everything at once. I know. Doctor said. I'm going to finish now. I'm going to see how they go. I'm going to see how they go. Ladies and gentlemen, the first performance of the evening happens after the break. Stand by. The coming to DTH has been an amazing experience. For we, the Brothers in Arms family, I mean, selecting just six members to represent Brothers in Arms from out of about 15 or more, it was a difficult decision for us to make, but we made that decision. So the experience so far here has been so amazing. I mean, we never expected to get this far in the competition. 
coming down here to DTH camp, meeting awesome people, different talents, like having the privilege to meet other talents that are good. Like apart from this stuff, I just wish them good luck. Apart from DTH, like they are really, really good. Dancing on DTH stage has been super amazing. Um, this is our first time on a big stage. Um, for the first time, we're climbing a big stage and me making it this far is actually surprising to us because we didn't um, see ourselves coming this far. After seeing the big, big talent here, yeah, the singers, the magicians, we were actually afraid from the start when we, when we came to camp. But here we are, finals. Win or win, we'll take the fact that this particular stage has actually made us courageous. So wherever we head to or wherever we go to, we'll always be courageous and we'll be able to stand at any possible stage outside or inside Nigeria. That's what the experience in DTH have done to us and for that, we give God the glory. Now these are the Nigerian Spirit finalists. And our mission is to take them down one by one. Now we start from Boivi down to the downstairs. Strike down to King Sars, then to the main target. Are you ready? Yes, sir! Are you ready? Yes, sir! Are you ready? Yes, sir! Now, let's go take them down. Let's go! It's Val. Bartons! What is your profession? This is where we hold the Hey, I'm in the mood to fire. To fire, get I'm in the mood to fire. Open fire, get I'm in the mood to fire. To fire, get I'm in the mood to fire. Open they are actually brothers in arms. They don't need to carry ammo. Dance is their weapon. Let me love your package. I wanna let it down, baby. If I give you one, I go give you two. My love, I'm ready. Say you love me. Thank you, that's so. Don't give me so. Tell them I'm cool. It's electrifying. I just want to ask the audience one question. If you choke, I mean, no choke. That's your answer right there. <laughs> well, brothers in arms, well, today is the D-Day, and you guys are constantly up in your game. I'm just so proud of you guys. See how far you've come? Are you excited? Great job tonight, guys. And the costuming is everything. Well done. Brothers in arms, like I said, you kill everything with no weapons because the weapons are your legs and your feet and your oneness as brothers. You guys killed it. Nice performance, nice outfit. Good one. From week one to this point, you know, it has been an amazing experience. I won't even lie. You know, I had my ups and downs. I think the beauty of it all is, um, you know, learning from all these mistakes, bringing your hundred every week, every week. And then that has brought me to the finals. And I'm, even, I'm, I'm like surprised, you know, I think the judges said one thing about me. It's about my ability to learn and to listen. So I think that's, that's what has brought me to the final. The lessons I've learned being here is taking, um, adhering to constructive criticism and coming out with your best every week. And also there's this thing I always hear, you wake up in the morning, you see the winner when, when you look into the mirror and 
when in time that keeps ringing it keeps ringing in my ears you know you wake up in the morning you look at the mirror you see the winner so i believe that everyone here is a winner so far you've been on this platform you're a winner and um, win or lose i'm still a winner you love me I believed you blatantly I've heard all of me baby all my friends they warned me that you'll be the end of me it's too late now I don't turn zombie zombie lover shiba shiba shiku shakalaka yeah give your order you're my queen and she says she ba she be she ku shaka la ka ye Zombie lover Follow me I don't follow you go far away Anywhere that you go oh yeah I hear you calling my name my name Anywhere that I go oh yeah in your heart and I don't want you to set me free you got me hypnotized your command is my wish baby I am your host you control me with your remote cast a spell on every note got me dancing like I'm a ghost I wanna be lost in your eyes I wanna be lost Whatever the cost is, I just wanna be lost with you. I wanna be lost, baby. I just wanna be, be the one for you, my love. You, you, yeah, you, you, my love. Zombie lover, she must, she may, she could shock a lot. Give your order. You're my queen, my queen, and she says she ba she be she ku shaka la ka ye. Zombie lover, follow me. I go follow you, go far away. Anywhere that you go, oh yeah. I hear you calling my name, my name. Come on. Anywhere that I go, oh yeah. so much man I love you I haven't heard this song before is it your original piece it's my original piece oh well you get mine do <laughs> you get mine like it's it's amazing to see that you you have grown so much in confidence enough to perform your own song on a final day performance I, I personally I think I enjoyed your performance and I enjoyed your song Thank and uh, that song would be hit. One hit song. So, is this your original song? Is that what you said? My original song. It's it's. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, V. First of all, it's a beautiful song. Thank you. It's I I, I thoroughly enjoyed it. I actually thought it must have been something from the fella family or something like that. Just that it was more subtle than what they would ordinarily do. But it, it's, I mean, I would definitely download that song. And you put up a beautiful performance. You see what I said? You've grown. I'm so, I'm so proud of you. Thank well you. done. Hi, Boy V. Hi, Liko. Uh, that was a great song. I didn't know that was your original song. I enjoyed it. The song was nice. But that was not your best performance. Since you've been on this show, I'm gonna be. That's me. This is me being brutally honest with you. That's not your best performance. The song is great, beautiful song. It's going to. It's going to have so many streams because I would download it. I would vibe to it myself. It's a mad song, but I felt like you'd have done more with your performance because it's the finals. Come on, song 100 percent performance, 50 over 100. Thank you. Um, 
it's funny because I share the same sentiment with with liquor. I think the song is absolutely amazing. The fact that I performed it, and I didn't know that it was, I thought it was something I'd heard before, which means your writing and that, the lyrics on that song are absolutely amazing, but your performance for me was lackluster today. It is not your best. You've done a lot better. I don't know whether your voice is tired or something. It wasn't really all there for me, but that song is absolutely amazing. Well done. Thank you so much. Coming to the Ninja Spirit Talent Hunt has been an amazing experience in my life and um, this is my first reality TV contest so far and um, you know it's been it's been awesome all the way it's been awesome I've been through a lot in the in the whole episode of the Ninja Spirit Talent Hunt a whole lot of experiences and um, I still give God all the glory for bringing me up to the final. My stage experience in DTH has been um, has been awesome. My first stage experience, I I wasn't scared, I wasn't frightened, I wasn't tensed. Yeah, I was myself because it's it's what I do often. For the live show experience, you know what I've learned from the live show is uh, you know coordination matters. You know how you coordinate yourself, how you put yourself together. You know the whole lot of pressures and um, a whole lot of things that happens on the live show but all you just need to do is you know just be coordinated just you know just get used to the system and uh, be coordinated and you put yourself together and there you go Like you never left baby and you look like of course you look like a you look like a superstar as usual you know so, so last week you, you you almost broke my heart but trust me this week you've made it all up I'm so glad that you chose to make this performance your own we could hear you throw all through every single note you hit that was a great performance I'm really 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 proud of you well done so we need to change your name now to Dr. Sachs because this one that you're breaking and mending hearts, it won't, it won't go. 
Honestly speaking, last week was, was shambles. This week, I saw yes. the King Sax that we know in this exact tournament. Yes. Absolutely amazing. This is supposed to be your Bonner boy look, Abby. <laughs> I'm feeling you. I, I love it. You know, King Sax, I see you doing great things, performing on the biggest stages. Well done on amazing performance. It's final day, and I wish you all the best. King Sax. Me, I'm, I'll just say this real quick, yeah? I, I think I need to learn how to play the sax. Because um, since you can mend a broken heart with, with sax now, we don't need to buy flowers anymore. <laughs> um, King Sax, you are an outstanding performer. By the way, shout out to Alternate Sounds. Um, that's one of my favorite play. I play that, um, that particular... It's, 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 it's um, in my playlist and I play it all the time. And you got me thinking if they should have actually had you in the song in the first place. Outstanding performance. King Sax, you look dashing like you always come in through your outfit. <laughs> yeah, I forgot to say last week because, yeah, no, you didn't break my heart. Because <laughs> I knew, I know it's in Apple, so you understand. That is a winning performance. That was great. You are what a true performer should look like. How you dance, you play the sax, and you interact with the crowd is amazing. Win or not, I would like to say congratulations to you for being a great performer. My experience at the Niger Spirit Talent Hunt has been amazing. It has been beautiful. I mean, I've had bad days, I've had good days. Well, I'm, I'm like grateful for all of them. From the first day I got to camp till now, I don't think I've actually fought to anybody in that camp. I've been getting positive vibes from everybody. My first performance on the DTH stage was actually one of my best performances on the stage. And the judges actually loved it. Um, Ine Edo gave me her royalty and I won the royalty for that week. Win or win, I would actually say I've learned a lot. Apart from winning the prize, I mean, as a person, I've actually developed myself during these 10 weeks. I mean, my stay here in the, in the Niger Spirit Talent Hunt. It has been amazing. I've learned a lot. So even if I don't win, if I, even if I don't win first place or second place or third place, I've actually acquired a lot. But whether I win or not, I know that I'm already a winner. It's a win-win for me because right now, without, without even getting the prize, I'm already a winner and I know that I'm a winner because I'm not leaving DTH the same way I came in. I mean, I came with less followers and all that, but right now I'm actually going with like a lot of followers and engagement. I'm known to the world now, so it's actually a win-win for me. Hi guys, so I would really appreciate it if you just put on your phone touch light and just wave it in the air like this. Yeah, I see you. <laughs> there is a place in your heart and I know that it is love and this place can be much brighter than tomorrow. And if you really try, you find there's no need to cry this place you find there's no heart of sorrow and there are ways to get there if you care enough for the living make a better place make a little space heal the world make it a better place for you Make a better place for you and for me. Heal the world. Make it a better place for you and for me. And the entire human race. There are people dying. If you care enough for the living, make a better place for you and for me. Sing along, everybody, let's go. Heal the world. 
Tessie sings. Tessie, 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 Tessie. Tessie, can I be honest with you? Was an almost very, was an almost outstanding performance. And that's almost just somewhere there. I mean, you got the crowd rowing. There are some points where you hit some very nice notes, and there are still some points where you lost it. All in all, I, I, I enjoyed your performance. I enjoyed it. Where did this superstar come from, please? Desi Sings, listen, let me tell you something. There's nothing anybody would say about this performance tonight. Nothing. Nothing. From, from beginning, from the confidence you walked into, that, walked into the stage with, to when you finished delivering your song, where have these Desi Sings been? You waited till the last day to unleash this level of aggression, of, of sensuality, of confidence, of superstar. Of, you would go. Listen, listen. For me, this is your best performance in this competition. 100% hands down, and that's my honest opinion. And girl, I don't think you should make, no, I don't think you should allow anybody to make you feel otherwise. You killed it tonight. Well done. Tessie. Hi, Tessie. Hello, first. First of all, I want you to say to yourself with the mic, see, I'm a winner. I'm the winner. Do you know why I said that? Yes. You beat the biggest competition you have, that you had. That was fear. Yes. That was lack of self-confidence, and you beat it. So let me tell you, you have to know in yourself that you're a winner. Okay, you came out, you came on, onto the stage and you were shiny, vibrant, the energy was, the crowd had no choice than to yell for you. The beauty is not what you're wearing, it's your smile, baby girl. It's your smile. The performance, dope, uh, because that's my favorite artist of all time and that song was very special to me. I, this makeup took me hours, so I didn't want to tear up on it. I love that performance, I lo but one thing I love most today about you or since this show, is that new energy inside. Don't let it go, keep it. I agree with Aikisha. There were quite a few places where, but the truth of the matter is, you came on this stage today with a level of confidence that I've never seen from you. And I agree with Ini, this is your best performance in this competition. You, you did something which any performing artist will tell you say that the biggest ojuru on the planet. You involved the audience right from the beginning. And that energy, you siphoned it throughout your performance and you were shining. And I absolutely give you super toile for that because it's not easy to learn. Well done, great performance. Coming to DTH has been amazing, but I'll also say it's been a mix of emotions, especially with the kind of art that I have being spoken word poetry. But I think from my first performance, I had the energy and the confidence that I needed. It's been so amazing and I've fought through, I've made friends, I've missed friends as well, um, I've cried. I'm thankful for the platform, I'm thankful for the gift that I have and how it has moved people. I've received so much love from DTH fans, DTH social media handles, the family itself has been so overwhelming. I've tried my best to maintain my cool and be the best, to come up with different styles and give them content back to back and show them that there's an amazing side of poetry, there's an entertaining side of poetry. And I believe that I've been able to do justice to that. Being in the finals to me is an amazing news. It's so emotional for me because it hasn't been easy. I've really tried my best. So my final words for you guys would be, it's not easy. It's not easy to stand out. It's not easy to be the best at whatever it is that you do. 
but there's something that's very important which is hard work and there's the God factor as well and I promise you that you can do anything absolutely anything that you put your mind to nothing is impossible for you to do so just keep pushing for spoken word artists out there it's not easy but you need to prep yourself prepare yourself this is the stage this is the real world you need to build yourself to the point that people will see you and see your worth and see your value i trust you guys poet was an artist, would she succeed at it? Would my punchlines hit like a punch word or would people forget her like mothers and their passwords? Would she have to sing about her hustle? Because an artist must come from the ghetto just to get to the top. Be as versatile as young John. Kiss the music industry to get to the lion's den. Does she have to be Daniel? Better still pray to Jaho so she doesn't have to pack and go. Or maybe this poet, as the case may be, could be top 10 in making inspirations turn to hits like Makanaki, be the Don like Don Jazzy, make smart moves as smart as Abinos. But maybe she should just stick to poetry. What if this poet was a lover girl? Would she be able to woo any man as powerful as Wonder Woman? Let's try. IK. It's your ocean eyes for me by Billie Eilish. Yeah, my type of potato, I'm talking Irish. My carica papaya. My tomato juice. You look like a king, but can I call you my Ezenatio Bim? D. Kim. Agu. Finest man to ever walk the face of the earth. Whoosh. Sorry, I forgot to ask. Has Superman seen your arms? You are one hell of a fine superhero. And to the single guys, I need you to stare in my eyes. Married men, please look at your wife. Can I call you Oyoyo? Africa tallest man. Odogu, traditional prime minister. His royal highness. I would like to call you Male Cham. Your charm has me jazzed. Give that baba five stars. I'm on a diet, so I don't want your breakfast, so... How about we do dinner first? Thank you. Okay, um, I, <laughs> I, <laughs> okay. <laughs> I can't speechless. <laughs> okay, first of all, I have a secret to share. You've been one uh, talent I always look forward to see every time I come here. But I didn't make that known because I've never saved you, have I? You have just once. Once. I could have saved you several times. But you see, what you did today for this show is flawless. Thank you, Mama. We're telling you. Thank you. That is what a spoken word artist should do on stage in a competition like this. Thank do you understand? You look very beautiful. Thank you. Your punchlines, your play on words, your Thank metaphor, you. your sarcasm, your simile, everything. I saw you, it and you've Thank been you. amazing. And I like to, I hope you win. I hope you win. Thank but you. Don't, don't put your hand beside you. Stand, stand where we're, stand gallant. Not in square. You're okay, you're all right. I can't have fun. Ah, you don't think it, woman, toast me. <laughs> I hope I did it. I didn't job. see that coming. I promise you. <laughs> I be quick. I always tell you I love you. I mean, it's... I love you too. <laughs> I love you. I be quick. Um. Let me take away this uh, moment and Aww. attack the performance. Outstanding. Thank you. Up until today, I thought your Independence Day performance was the best. But I stand corrected. This one, wow. yeah. they get as it take B. Yeah. 
<laughs> you see, eh, one thing that every woman should know is every man loves when their woman praises them, gives them accolades. They will remove money. They will remove anything and give you. Today, I'll be quick. You spoke to the soul of every African man. God bless you. Thank you. <laughs> I be quick. Girl, say. Hmm. Obviously, I know that. Well, this, I can needed this, actually. He needed this. So, I, I think we need to find something to contain his head before he will blow out the stage because I've watched him finish. Anyway, hmm. girlfriend. You are, you know, when I look at you, right, I'm a theater artist. So when I look at you, this, I just, I can't, there's no way I cannot place you in, in, the, in the genre of art. There's really no way I cannot place you. You are literally a full and total package. Like, I just thought, I don't know what you would become. I don't know what you want to do for yourself, who you want to be in, in life, but... I don't, don't go anywhere outside the inter creative industry because they need you. We need you. We need your content. We need the way you twist words. The way, it, it just, it's just, if you want to try writing, whatever it is, like you said there, why is you going to be? Just do anything your mind is set out to do. You will succeed. You are very brilliant. I already can tell that you're a very brilliant person. You're very intelligent, first of all. So finding your parts would be very easy for you. And I wish you all the best. Today's performance was needed. We needed to break away from the very uh, serious topics and just do something refreshing. So this was a very refreshing side of you, and it was really nice to look at, to watch. Well done. Thank you, Mama. And you're stunning, by the way. Thank you, Mama. You too. I'll be quick. Don't stand. When is my, when is my turn? She go give me one kind of eye, like say I'll be eyeing me. <clears throat> so. Throughout this entire competition, your poetry has been stellar. At times, I found it monotonous and repetitive. And when it comes to talent competitions, I always like to think, where's the commercial value? How do you turn this talent into something that sustains you throughout your life? You see today's performance, eh? I go pay to watch that one. Because your delivery was fresh. It was different from everything you had done throughout this entire competition, which leads me to believe that the layers of IB Quick have not yet been seen, and there's more to you, and there is no depth with which you would not go to to bring out what is necessary to be successful. So, I am highly impressed. And I thank you because you get one cap where I won't give IK, but as he head does swear that, you don't want collect him again. <laughs> Absolutely amazing performance. And I want to tell you something. See, that man right there, that is your biggest fan. IK has fought for you throughout this entire competition. You understand? He believes in you more than you know. And I want to say thank you for giving a final performance that is befitting of that. Second runner from last season show. Please give it up for Slim Saint. He choke, I mean, no choke. If I say A, hey, you say A, A, A. Oh my God, I miss you. Did you miss me? Yeah. <laughs> I'm shy. Somebody do all for me. Oh God, God. <laughs> oh my, time not really there. We go just misbehave before time go go. My brother, calm down. You go laugh, relax. If you know you are proudly single, make some noise. Hold on. Waity, waity. If you know you're there here, you are a lady, you don't depend on any motherfucking nigga to spend money on you. Make some noise! 
In the Edo, in the Edo is making noise. If you know you day here, you're my category. Nobody like say you day relationship. Nobody like say you know day, but I shower day your eye. Make some noise. He choke, I be in no choke. Hey. In case you're meeting me for the first time, uh, people will know me for don't craze by now. In case you never know. Uh -huh. My name is Comedian Slim Saint. I'm a comedian blessed with the talent and grace to make normal people laugh for a living. Uh, aside comedy, I'm a part-time bouncer and a professional gym instructor. If you know, believe, rest. Now you, they do the work. Uh, and I may win uh, two million last year. <laughs> My brother, that two million big, oh, but... <laughs> You know, say, get the way you go get family problem. Two million go humble. <laughs> my brother, as I win that two million, if you see Billy wake on my side, Agbero from my side, they say, hey, portable. I say, I know be portable. <laughs> they say, you know, go like do Zazu for us. I say, wait till Apple. He said, just buy me loud, 50K. I don't know when I say, bro, no vessel. Which loud you smoke? To build me for this loud where you want smoke. People of God, they build it no loud. Yeah. Hey. As I win two million, my uncle for village, he called me. He said, hello, uh, comedian Slim Saints, I heard you won two million in DTH. I said, yes, sir. He said, please, I need your help urgently. My wife just swallowed fruit of the womb. Can you give me one perfect <laughs> I said, uncle, don't you want to be fruitful? <laughs> hey. hey. Um, uh, I love the love you all are showing me. A round of applause for yourself. Liquarose, <laughs> uh, no worry. You go understand. My fans, all of us, we know where. So ladies and gentlemen, uh, I say students, they are great Bobo. Great Baba. Oh um, uh, God go punish us for federal government. Eh? You know what they take our life to? February 14. They don't call us strike, Abi. February 14. All of us, they, they start strike. Everybody begin go out. Me. I mean, 10 people made them fear my return. My brother now, they don't call us strike. Now me, they fear to return. <laughs> Sakpa is dealing with me. You know what Sakpa don't do me? Sakpa make person will leave home to feed home, call home for a bag of rice. He don't rage. Sakpa will make them come out me for Bola's group chat. Add me for mechanic group chat. He took a me, no choke. Sakpa is dealing with people. Last year, I've been promised to make mama proud now. But with the look of things this year, oh, mama, mama, they make me proud. <laughs> hey, hey. He choke. I mean, he didn't choke. My brother, look at me. Not let anybody oppress you, not let anybody depress you. If you are passing through a lot, my brother, I'm just coming back from a lot. And I will tell you, a lot is going on in a... Yeah. Hey. Yeah. Look at me. As for our federal government, it is our career play. For eight months, they're talking stage. When they know be Stamara. Today, they go agree. Tomorrow, they go fight. Today they go... My school daughter, not on my school mother, because say she go private university. The idiot, she gave my semi picture. He said, oh, Please wish me well. Oh. Congrats on my NYC. I was posted to Kaduna. I said, Postino, we kill you. <laughs> oh, you want oppress? Hey, hey. hey. My brother, not let anybody oppress you. This life, now turn by turn. I said, like this now. I like advise people. No confuse yourself. Everybody's confused in this ni Nigeria. You know, so now out of confusion, you make one year old boy go register jam with a working US number. Now, in Jam Center, they New York. <laughs> hey, hey. hey! He choke, Abi, he no choke. He Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> hey, yeah, me, I get problems with some Nigerian girls. I don't know why. Why be so now? They like carry out another country problem put for your head. You can't drop your country problem outside. Queen Elizabeth died. May I so rest in peace, mommy. Sorry, you don't die. Go now. Our girls, they begin post for WhatsApp. Oh, R.I.P. A queen and more. Oh, ah, adieu, mama. Oh, we pay me. Now one girl we post. Oh, she was like a mother to me. Now ask the girl, which mother? Now she born you. The girl say yes. Now the mother that murdered my mother. Mother. Hey. hey. He choke, I mean, he no choke. Who <laughs> they? Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, they don't give me time, but we go steam, no man, no man. 
Ladies and gentlemen, Ibo Kwenu. Kwenu. Aba people that day here. If you offer your life, give Aba man. Eh, he go prize him. My brother, you don't say that only for Aba, eh? If they tell you, may you buy the fake or original. My brother, close eye, buy the fake. Because the original is faker than the fake. <laughs> now for Abba, now I say, make I go buy clothes. Make I drip on drip, you know, drip on drip. As a care of comedy, drip on drip. My brother, now I say, make I go buy clothes for Abba. I enter their shade. You see all those ritualist lights, where did they get? That's why I enter. I say, I won't buy Gucci shoe. I carry a come and I see Gucci. I enter, I see Puma, Pam. I carry a come and I see Puma of Big Brother. Pam, angels. I carry a come and I Pam, I angels. He won't weigh off me. Now, Balenciaga. I carry a come and I Ariza Balanga. Chelsea fans, they, eh? They won't weigh kill me, weigh off me. I say, I won't drip on. Now, see me, I join the Golden Boys, like I.K. Ogunna. You know? I won't feel among. That's why I said, bro, I won't buy 24 karat gold. He said, I get them. I said, how much? He said, one, two, five. I said, bring two. Out of greed. Now I carry and go out. Nine be this. <laughs> no, if to say nine be this, you're not going to really pay me. My pain. I say, instead of making sell, gold chain, give me the idiot. He said, magnetic iron, give me. Now, I get close to DJ, I go perform. I get close to DJ, I get hype. All right, ladies and gentlemen, bringing you back to back. All of a sudden, my neck begins. Magnet go DJ speaker. Now, the thing is stuck into the speaker. Come begin a drag, drag, drag. Now, the DJ begin para. He said, which kind? Yeah, yeah, baller on a carry gun club. Why person will not get blockchain, go using chain, block my speaker? He choke at me, he no choke. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, they can just talk one or two when I leave. Now, me win last year, I was part of the winners. So, when I don't see why I win, Abby, they'll be like, say, DTH, they scam. No, they are not scam. When they send me two million, my brother, the bank freeze my account. I say, why? They say they don't believe in me. How they get two million? My brother, hustle, every spirit of poverty, roll out for your head, roll out, roll out. If your hand they pay you, give your neighbor. Dr. C, thanks for following me back on Instagram. I really appreciate it. Look what rose, your rose go liquor. In the head though, we get beef. I ask, you know, say celebrities, they don't like give people their number. You foretell me. And that's why I asked Inedo for a number. She been give me, oh. But as I can't reach out now, I'll make up artist number she gives me. No be that one pay me, the one way boss my Lolo. Now I kill Buna. Give me your number. Now for airport, he said zero eight. He called her with a mouth. I was, you know, feeling at home. As I reach out, now she's saying I'm a personal photographer, number and give me. Up to now, the guy said, they tell me, bro, where will you come for photo shoots? I say, if I shoot you. Hey, hey. Judges, I mean, you must be proud. Come, let me start with Dr. Sid. Obviously, you saw him perform all through last season, and he's back as a superstar in his own right to perform again. How do you feel about this? No, Slim Saint has, he's, a, he's a, from day one. You he knew, he knew he had it in him, and you know, you can tell the way he's just pulls the crowd along. He's an amazing talent. <laughs> it's a total package. That's what I say. Oh, it's complete. Everything stop, it was. Joe. <laughs> you forget, say, Nami. Nami even make you get that two million. I'm sorry. <laughs> now, Joe. You know, say, comedian with the like, eh? talk nonsense. Nami, see, call, cause, joy. No verse. Eh? That number, look at where he bless you, miss one digit inside. <laughs> I'm so proud of him, guys. I mean, it's just it just goes to show the quality of show this is. That's right. The DTH is is a harbor for superstars, Absolutely. the next generation celebrities. I'm so proud. I mean, I'm just thinking to myself. I said, these guys should be really proud of this show because look at him. That's right. That's a product of the show. Absolutely. Guys, shoot me your tickets when you're ready. I'm gonna come for your show. You know. Oh my come God. on. <laughs> I can quickly. Yeah, I mean, Slim Saint was one of the, um, the greatest people to work on this stage. Um, last year was really tough, really, really tough. And it's just amazing to see how he keeps evolving with his arts, you know. By the way, for those people that don't know, he's the, he's the mastermind behind the choke or you know choke. <laughs> now me get the choke or you know choke. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, one more time, Slim Saint, come on. The Niger Spirit Talent on season two.
Hey, one more. <laughs> you know, days, but all the same, it's really been amazing. Um, I would really say the experience, the process, the stress, the straining, more especially the growth and exposure has really been overwhelming. I mean, I'm so grateful to God and I am so grateful to the Niger Spirit Talent Talents for this opportunity. It's just been great and I'm so, so grateful to God that I came. I mean, it's, it's a life-changing moment and I thank God. stage has really taught me a lot. I've learned to build confidence, self-confidence, okay? I've also gotten to know my audience. I get to know what to serve my audience in as much as I also need to make it so plain in a way that it will be generally accepted, okay? I've learned to be me. I mean, the, the stage has brought out another aspect of me I never knew that I, I had. What I will take home from this experience or my experience in the Nigeria Spirit Talent on season 2 is that I am a superstar in the words of uh, Miss Inedo and the rest of the judges. Win or lose, I am a winner, okay? And one um, advice I want to give to everyone out there looking at me right now is that I want you to be yourself in any platform you find yourself. Be yourself. Do not mimic another person. You are a solution to your generation. I believe that you have been called to a particular assignment and God has placed you there as a solution, okay? I want you to be yourself. Stay in your place of assignment and I believe that the Lord is going to see you through. Thank you so much and peace out. Aha! <laughs> One day, oh dear, oh dear. She never can make up why you just again. Every day by day I just get celebrate. Everything I do it just the penetrate. Oh. Ah, I just want to say oh thank you Jehovah. See I'm living like I get ten so from Abia State. Never forget where I come from now from Abba. Oh no 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 no. I just want to say oh thank you Jehovah. Everybody, we make a level road to talk father father. Put it rug on one a bed I need call look if I follow brother was query See I come from East and the street brother you know Ah hey, Jimmy Fay I come to be sick already know In my no na who never mon dum get fey Everybody Oh na who never make um get to ya own In my nandia who balum put um get the best Hey Oh na who balum put um that for ya so I not come all of you not just the wonder So wish come up and you under I fire them with the thunder Man I pose it one on you Oh no 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 Madu I cover myself Kure kele di bo to just Kuru teken 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 Yorima teken 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 They said, be careful what you ask for. <laughs> I asked for a very tough competition, and I'm getting one. Usually, um, a confession, yeah. I spent the a part of my 24 hours within the week watching a few of your videos on YouTube. Wow. And it beats me how you, you come on this stage every single week with this level of performance. With that high, high tone every single week. I, I'm, I'm wondering how come her voice is not strained? You know, you are a phenomenal talent, and um, there's really not much I can say to you. Thank you, sir. In every ramification, you have earned your spot, you. and 
like I said before, and I'll still say it again, you are destined for the biggest stage in life. Thank you, sir. UG Royalty. Week after week, you have scattered these halls with your powerful vocals. Thank you, sir. You, as a, as an, as a performing artist, I appreciate the way you work the stage. I don't think anybody understands how to, on this show, to give a live performance like you. You are a bundle of energy, and you always bring that. Personally, today, vocally, was not the best for me. I think you've had better vocal performances. And I think maybe, you know, so I say, maybe the thing on the, you don't try, you get. But I think, you know, over the course of this, um, this uh, competition, you have been stellar and outstanding, and I give you, you have my utmost respect for that. Today wasn't my best, but I know it's usual royalty now. You know how they go. Well done, my dear. Thank you, sir. Huge royalty. Oh my God. I told Indy before you came out, I'm like, I'm having goosebumps already. Because with you, you don't know what to expect. I don't know if I, am I going to stand up today? Am I going to start crying? Or you've been flawless all through the competition. You've been setting the bar high for you. I agree with him, though. Today was not your best due to vocal, but performance wise, you killed it, baby. 100%. Nobody on this show understands how to walk this stage and control the crowd like you do. Thank you. Yeah. <clears throat> Hey, baby girl. Good evening, Mama. You look really pretty tonight. Thank you. You too. Um, I, uh, it was a beautiful performance. You did amazing. I mean, obviously, you, you don't do no wrong, and that's the truth. Your voice is impeccable. I don't think I even have a right to judge your voice. That's the truth. Um, because your vocals are one that... It's just what it is. I think that you just do this music thing very effortlessly. It's a talent, it's what you're called into this life to do. Um, however, I don't know if it's the song choice or I kind of expected, um, I was hoping that, you know, um, being a fight, you know, the finale, you would perhaps try a different genre of music just so we, we just, you know, see your different strength. If it's about your vocals, nobody can contest, con contest it. It's amazing. It's flawless. It was an amazing performance. There's nothing more to say. Just that I was just, I was just praying in my heart that God let her come and sing like a Celine Dion or like a Whitney Houston. Not like this is, don't get me wrong. Yeah. Just something different. If you have a chance to make another pre uh, performance tonight, I mean, just, I would love to just see you do something different. But it was flawless and beautiful. Well done. Being a contestant in the Niger Spirit Talent Hunt has been an amazing journey. When I came to camp, meeting different talents, man, it, it, it wasn't easy, man, to, to meet different talents, contortionists, dancers, singers, uh, unicycles guys, and all those kind of things, competing against comedy, man, but we just had to pray, rehearse, practice, and do our best, and by God's grace, we are here in the final, like, if a prophet had told me that, ah, Master Seb, you will get to the final, I for first put the prophet here for my armpit, not come. Because I, would, I, I, I wouldn't have believed. Because, like, from day one till now, all contestants have been 100%, like, they have been giving it back to back. And by God's grace, I'm part of the contestant that, that made it to the final. I'm happy. I want to give God the glory for first giving me the opportunity to be in GTA. This, this is like one of the major competitions I've been in and um, I just came for the experience but he has taken me this far, like to the finals.
Take it. Hey, we know. Hey, hey. Hey, with all due respect, Inedo, give them the honor of unveiling the newly wedded virgin. Unveil it. Una know they shout for you. Me not scream now. Ah. Uh -uh. Eh. Ini. Da. That kiss where you kissed me last week. I never recover from her. So, I know say you don't know say we don't start relationship. So, now I say, Marco. But people they verse. Say, hey, why you go just kiss me for one side? Say, Bible talk, say, if they slap you for one side, may you turn the other side, may they. So now we'll be saying, I don't kiss when you kiss me for one side, just complete them. <laughs> precious, precious, how you see? That? Precious, my ex, talk say, I can never see a girl better than her. Are you better than Iniedo? Ladies and gentlemen, in here though, waiting remain and I to come see my family. Some of them come here. We know for my village, 15 years that you don't marry us. Ladies, but well, wait, oh, what is Una guess? Una they like oppress Una fellow guests when Una enter relationship. For WhatsApp status, if any girl enter relationship for WhatsApp status, you're going to see updates. Any updates, what I call, you go just shout, oh. When you go WhatsApp status of girl, you just enter a relationship. You go hear things like, love is blind. Oh. There is a man for every woman. Oh. Love conquers all. Oh. They will come talk, they will already pain us. Wala for who know they love, oh. But go that same gay, when she break up. Any update, what I call, you say, hey, yeah. When you go that same girl, what's up status? Where till you go to see now? Trust nobody. Yeah. All men has come. Yeah. They want where they pay me. They'll come they shout. Now Mumu they love. You've been not know before. Rubbish. And please, are they, are they advise girls? Especially guys, when you toast gay. Uh. When you toast gay and get no grief, no worry. That's why I'm still a virgin. Because Bible is supporting us. Me not worry. Multimedia. Isaiah 4 verse 1. Wait the Bible talk. And in that day, wait it happen. Shall do what? Come out now. In that day, several women shall take hold of one man. All of, all of una, all of una, una, they hurry to do three some and they wait. God has promised me seven some. <laughs> Finally, on behalf, on behalf of the married couple, we don't bring that list. Say all the girls in this category, you are still single. So any category what I call, just answer single. Una, they hear me? All those girls where they shout, we have been dating for five years. You are what? They will come and shout. We just got engaged. You are what? He posts my pictures on social media. You are what? His friends call me our wife. You are what? His mother call me our daughter. You are what? I cook for him. You are what? I be have a child for him. You are what? They will come and talk. Say, he promised to come and see my parents by December. You are what? The next, our pastor said we are meant for each other. You are what? Until they marry you, you sign marriage register. You are what? Thank you very much. I remember to say. Uh, I. <laughs> Thank God, say you are. You don't be engaged now. Thank you. Happy married life to me. Yes, because people are saying since this competition starts, you don't define relationships since. You, you know, say even King Sars can't follow me, they drag in you do. <laughs> you say you say even. It, 
You can they do spirit fingers. <laughs> they don't kiss me two times. <laughs> Who win? <laughs> Their father. <laughs> Their daddy. <laughs> you they follow me, Draguma. <laughs> Anyways, um, you know, I think you you've just shown tonight the reason why you are in the finals. You get everybody that has watched this competition from the beginning knows your talent. The world knows your talents. People are watching. And after this competition, win or not, the, the, really, the world is yours. And it is left to you to take it. I want to say well done and congratulations on an amazing show. Thank you, sir. <laughs> uh, <laughs> happy married life. Seems not. Thank you. <laughs> First of all, I'd like to say I'm happy to be a part of your success story. Because I know you're going to be so. very, very successful. Yes, I don't I... vote for you for... God bless you. <laughs> yes. If they don't know, men are votes. Uh, oh. Yeah. <laughs> you are amazing. You're extraordinary. You're one of the best comedians I've seen in my life. And Thank you. How you control the crowd, your comedy is very original, and your facial expression kills me every time. You are super talented. I hope, I pray you win, you know. And um, when you snap picture, you uh, know, you forget, you know, snap, you know, use uh, uh, this thing, your phone. Uh, not true. Camera, so you go put them together. Capture that second kiss. Man, no here later, say, uh -huh. you guys were back So, hold. I know today's the final. No, no slack. Keep in touch. Thank you. I did root for you. Thank you. Um, Master Seb, congratulations. Thank you so much. Oh, and small. So, you are the chairman of the ceremony. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I don't want to be the chairman. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, Master Seb, like I said, you have been very consistent. Your growth right from the very beginning of this competition till date is um, amazing. I don't know if it was intentional that you made us believe in the slow start and then you just took into some fire zone, but you are, your originality is uncomparable. Thank you, sir. And for that, you have my utmost respect. Thank you very much, sir. The, the groom, the groom. Oh, wait, yeah. me, the groom. Let the groom speak, please. I love you too. Ah! <laughs> you, oh my gosh, CM. If you so, the most exciting thing for me is just seeing the level of talents that this show is producing. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what to say, I swear to God. See, my guy, we go marry in heaven. <laughs> eh? We we'll marry in heaven. <laughs> anyway, let me tell you something. All right. I mean, I just want to come your show, Sha. I just want, trust me, I've been to so many, several comedy shows, and even with, you were, you were so good. Thank you. You're too good. I want to come for your show. Aww. As a fan, John. Uh -huh. Well done tonight. Thank, uh -huh. you. <laughs> Thank you. Good night. The experience on the DTA season two has been amazing. Yeah. All glory to God. From the moment we came here and now, oh, has been great. It has been really amazing. When we got on this DTA stage and met the judges for real, Hmm. It was mind blowing. We also did our best at the first time. But when we saw that talent, we have to buckle up. Even with the with the good comment we got the first time, we had to buckle up. Win or win, the lesson we are going to take from this whole experience here in, the, in DTH season two is that we can actually be very creative if we can actually put our minds to think. Like uh, in the other we always say, don't be tight to yourself, you can, you can do more. So I believe going out there, hmm, there's no dance job that we cannot undo. Because DTH has taught us a lot. A week, a performance, a week, a performance, a week, a... Ah. 
Yeah. That's one thing I would take. Win or win. to a different dimension. Excruciatingly difficult for us. <laughs> um, it, it's been a while that we enjoyed breakdance, this level of breakdance. I mean, back then in my father's days and when I was growing up, it was a thing. And ever since then, other styles of dance came in. But you just take us back to why breakdance was still a thing and should still be a thing. And I will tell you this, this style of dance is, for me, the best version of you guys. I love it. You, the synergy between two of you is insane. It's insane. You guys are so in sync with one another. It's so beautiful to watch. Like, I'm just like, wow. It's unbelievably good. I love that you decided not to throw yourselves around today and just stand there and do that. It's the confidence, it's the professionalism, it's the fact that you understand your craft and you know that it's not always about just, it's, it's a diversity. It's beautiful. That's what, see, I don't know how we're going to do this, guys, but this competition, you make it excruciatingly difficult again. Well done. Congratulations. The energy, the synergy, what you guys did with telling a story, your facial expression, I don't know how you do that. Timing, delivery, flawless for me. You understand? Amazing performance. Well done. I can't, I can't wait to see what's next for you guys. Man, you guys are... <laughs> yes, yes. That was everything. That was everything. That was amazing. That's a winning performance. Trust me, Anne. I respect you guys, hands down. All the respect to you guys, because what you did is not easy. It takes a lot of hard work, time, sleepless nights, you know. That was nice, the technique you guys are into. I like the fact that you're doing that kind of dance to a commercial song, you know, to a viral song. I enjoyed it, and I'm rooting for you guys. I'm rooting for you guys. Coming to Ninja Spirit Talent Hunt Season 2 has been a very, very great experience for me. Starting from moving from Abuja to DTH camp, I met a lot of people, I met talents. I was like, hey, talent, choke. <laughs> 
I was I was scared to be honest because there, there are a lot of singers and I'm happy that those singers it's just one of us that left which is sad but we are here to the finals we are here in the finals and I'm so glad I met a lot of people um, the DTH experience has been challenging it's been a very 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 great experience and I, I can't even believe that I'm in finals I did I didn't expect it <laughs> What I will take from um, my DTH experience is um, wherever you find yourself, always be open to change. Like you, everything cannot, be, every day cannot be Christmas, like they say, and it cannot be as comfortable as your house. Being in DTH camp has taught me a lot. Like most things are not comfortable, but you just have to, you know, adapt and acclimatize to, you know, the, the environment. My advice for people is when um, in life, when you are corrected or Whatever experience you have, always pick a lesson from it, a positive lesson, and like try to work and improve yourself. And amongst people, do not like, like I said, talent choke. At the point, I was scared, like, who am I, me, that have the softest voice? <laughs> but then I didn't let that pull me down. Just remain in your act, believe in yourself, and just do you, and just do you. That's 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 the advice I'll give anyone out there. Shine bright like a diamond I light in a beautiful sea I choose to be happy You and I, you and I With the diamonds in the sky You're the beautiful star I see A vision of ecstasy When you hold me I'm alive With the diamonds in the sky I knew that we'd become one right away, yeah. oh right away yeah. At first sight I felt the energy of sun rays I shine the light tonight so shine bright Tonight you and I were beautiful like diamonds in the sky Like a diamond, shine bright like a diamond. Oh, 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 Helena, you, you, you know, maybe after this competition, you'd have to explain to me what happened to you the first two to three weeks of this competition. Because for the last three weeks, I don't follow. For the last three weeks, you have been almost pitch perfect. You delivered difficult songs with ease. I was listening to that song, I got worried for you in certain parts of it, but you delivered it and you brought it home. You get, um, I, I, I'm happy to see your growth and I'm, I'm, I'm hoping you do really well in this competition. It's very, very strong performance. Well done. Uh, Elena, you're one person that makes me feel proud to be among these amazing people as judges on this show because yes, they have done their job. 
let me feel proud. We have done our job. <laughs> you know, your growth is amazing. You sang that song. I don't know if anyone else can do it better the way you just did it, you know, because I love that song so much. I know all the ad libs and the backups, and you killed everything for me. That was an amazing performance, and I'm so, so happy for your growth. Your growth and your wins are very personal to me, and I wish you the best of luck tonight. Helena, oh my God, we are in trouble though, it's just crazy, like I don't even know, what, well this is the competition, girl you just, you, you keep taking it to the next level week after week and the growth, that's what everybody's talking about, it's the growth, I mean um, one or two, three weeks into the competition I never would think you would have survived till today, but now you are one of the toughest contenders of this competition. So, I just, that, like Liko said, the, for me, this is the most fulfilling part of this job. Just, you know, sporting talent, identifying potentials, and nurturing them, and, you know, going through the critic and seeing them process the critic and grow from strength to strength. You have a future in music. I just, I look forward to when you open up your mouth to really sing the big notes, because it's just flawless. I, well, you just, it's tough, but well done. You look beautiful and be proud, be really, really proud. That was a great, great performance. Hello, Helena. Um, Helena, you know I love you, right? But I'm, I'm more in love with your hunger, your passion, and your desire to make it to the top. Um, seeing you on this stage tonight makes me very proud. Because I saw through your mistakes at a point, and I just wanted to see you give me this exact kind of performance. And... I am very proud that you've been able to do it not just once or twice, but three or more times. And you deserve that spot you're standing on right now, on this very day. And like Ini said, if I can steal her word, you're making it excruciatingly hard for us. Thank you for being you and for getting to this point that you've gotten to so far. Welcome back to the show. This is the Nigeria Talent Horn Season 2 Grand Finale. 22 contestants started the live shows. We're down to the top nine. And in a few moments, we'll be down to the top five. Without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, please, I need your support. Please welcome your top nine. On stage right now are your top nine contestants. Based on your votes from last week, the first contestant leaving the competition is Unfortunately, the journey ends here for Brothers in Arms. Based on the votes from last week. The first contestant in your top five is... Congratulations, I be quick, you're in the top five! The next contestant leaving the competition based on the votes from last week is unfortunately Helena. The journey ends here. She's been pretty good. Thank you so much. Take a bow. Well done. The next contestant in the top five is Congratulations, King Sags, you're in the top five. Yeah. 
Next up, ladies and gentlemen, based on the judge's verdict, the next contestant leaving the competition is Boy V, the journey ends here. Take a bow, you've been pretty good. Thank you so much for sharing your talents with us. The next contestant in your top five is UG Royalty, congratulations. The next contestant in your top five is Master Sab. It's pretty hot. That means one of them is joining the top five and the journey will end for the other. The contestants in the top five, and that means automatically the next contestant is evicted. That's what that means. So ladies and gentlemen, the last contestant joining the top five is Congratulations, Delta All Stars! <laughs> and that means the journey ends for Tessie Sings. Well done. Get ready for your next performance. Stand by. After the break, your top five will take the stage and perform for the very last time. Stand by. Vibes maneuver the jet ski Cause I said regard the part of the Red Sea Multi-million dollar commercials for Pepsi From food stamps to more ice than Gretzky I don't gotta talk, the Lord defends me I watch them all fall from going against me Cause me and all my angels shut the devil up While you was trying to pull me down, I leveled up I leveled up twice, I leveled up three times He tapped them and told them she's mine So even when I cried I knew I'd be fine Prepare for a miracle blessing in these times Now praise it, praise it, name it, claim it Every tongue that rises up against me, shame it I breathe success in and now my lungs Got the power, life and death coming out my tongue If they fear the Capone, they got to fear this God There's no use challenging me because I'm used to battles It's beauty and brains in the jungle Yeah, pinky when I'm the brain, be humble I'm amused you are used to playing judge of the jungle. I'm the type to bring a gun to a knife fight. Don't be myopic, you're missing the point like you miss plight. I'm covered. My drip may not be Gucci, but I'm dipped in the blood. I spit bars. I'm qualified like I'm called to bar. My words in prison strongholds, yes, I'm called to bar. Melanin glow, baby, tasty chocolate bars. I be breaking the records, I'm raising the bar. I be quake, quakes the earth like an underground whale. I'm not on the surface like an underground jail. I roll in the deep. So when I speak my words, my lyrics will slap you harder than an underground whale. I'm charged with battery when my tongues do the kabashing. I'm always charged because it's all on heaven's battery. Hands down, I'm God's winner. But people wouldn't see it like Stevie Wonder. Lord, open their eyes to see the light. I've watched you heal the blind. Not that they're blind, but they wouldn't see the truth like Potiphar. I pray as you've made me bold and unashamed, you make your people become Gideon, mighty men with valor. Nimrod, the mighty hunter, you've made me like Esther, a lolo in the palace. And for every singles, let every root find their boas. Breathe your breath like your spirit did upon the waters. Let the Ruach Elohim invade hearts as he did on Pentecost. And let every man receive an awakening. So in every journey, I'm thankful. He says I'm the apple of his eyes. 
to swallow your Adam's apple and digest your pride. Because we can all win together now that we've seen the light. And guess what? I am that light. I think all the judges are speechless right now. <laughs> I'll be quick. Mm. Uh, I thought your previous um, performance was the best for me so far, but this is the best so far. Thank you. That was very, very... <laughs> me too, I'm speechless, yeah? That was mad. That was beautiful. Thank you. You're, you're just amazing, and you go places, you go very far, because you're a superstar already, baby girl. And yeah, you're the light. Let your light shine so bright. You wrote this this particular performance for this particular performance to let everybody know that at this particular point in time it is you you see what I did there um, I think that was a befitting final performance I think it was very powerful the words spoke a lot to who you are and what you intend to be what you intend to do and how you see the world um, and I think that was very powerful well done Let me speak so Ike can talk last. Ike can give you the last words from this table. Girl, wait, let me sit well. <laughs> you're amazing. You're amazing. You're really, really amazing. You're full of surprises. You're like, you're like this package that, you know, like they say, small packages, you don't know what you'll find inside. And every time you come out, it's, a breath of fresh air, something new, something different. I, I, I'm not surprised because, I mean, like I always tell you, I think that you can do way much more than you have even realized. I'm just, I just want to watch how your life journey would be. I'm excited about the next phase of your life. Well done. Great job. You are a winner in life. You are a winner within yourself and amongst your pair. The only disappointment I would ever get from you is you not using this platform and multiplying it. Because you have everything it takes. Everything. Not minusing anything. Everything it takes to take your talent to the apex. And if you don't use it, that's the only failure that you have given yourself. So right now, you have a lot of work to do on you, with you, to take you to where you deserve to be. That's all I would say.
Ay, 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 ay. <laughs> King Sass, catch your breath. <laughs> King Sacks, this performance is a perfect example of bringing your heart on stage and leaving it on stage. You didn't only bring your heart, you brought your lungs. This performance is beyond epic. I'm a huge fan of jazz. I like going to jazz bars. But I actually believe, and I stand corrected, that you perform this song better than the original owner of the song. Madu. Was that, was that Kenny G? That's Kenny G. Okay. Uh, yeah, you try. I can't lie. It is, you know, breath control is something that is so hard to do. I had a friend of mine walk on a small treadmill this morning, don't they breathe? To lie down on the floor and breathe and blow that saxophone is not beans. My brother, you look great, you sound great, and you had a great performance. Well done. Wow. Uh, King Sack. It's so soothing, so beautiful. <laughs> Please. <laughs> I, I, I understand you. I know where you're coming from. It's been a long journey and all that. And that was a very beautiful one. And you look, look really good. And not just your looks, you know how, you know what you, um, you know how to do what you do best. Do you understand? So, um, I'm rooting for you, you know. Win or not, you're a born winner, you're a born star. I can go to a show of you and just watch you perform all night. You make um, jazz so beautiful and complimenting. Nice one. Listen to the fights for the love. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Listen. This particular song choice tonight is the smartest decision you have made in this competition. This was all you. It's about how you want, you just want to, you, you know, it's like saying, look, I know the show is ending, but I'm going to make you guys remember me. You come out here and this was all you. There's no background. Uh, uh, in, no, there's a background interference, but it's not interfering with your performance. So I can see you in all your glory, and it is so beautiful to watch. See, I don't know what will happen if you're going to win this competition, but you deserve to win. You deserve to be a winner. You deserve... Look, I don't know what's going to happen, but listen... You were, I'm just proud that you chose this particular performance and gave it your very best. So whether or not you win tonight, you are a gifted, one of the best saxophonists that will ever exist in this country and in this continent. So that alone, you can take it to the bank. Well done. I'm proud of you and how far you've come. You should be proud. Did they wind me? Proud Crossiveria, they are papa. Did they wind me? Play that song again. DJ Ola, ladies and gentlemen, I am a proud Crossiveria. If you know say you did proud to be a Crossiveria, put your hands together for yourself. <laughs> for this Crossiveria, we get place where they call Calabar South. If you know say you did with your phone and you did go Calabar South, Ola Welo, prevention is better than not be the phone they pay me, now they seem they pay me. <laughs> Now this country, this country, avoid motivational speakers. Now motivational speakers tell my guy, face your fears, face your fears. That's my friend. He got a face dog. Dog owners are the most proud set of human beings. How you go get dog? I'll be your friend. You know, say I fear dog. I 
come to come visit you. Your dog there on with that shame, no. You don't tell me, come inside, the dog will not bite you. Now the dog tell you. <laughs> and he gave it to that they do for condolence message. Persever don't die. Una go write condolence message at the end. Una go come put, we will meet to part no more. Stop her mo. We meet to part no more. What if you go hair fire? <laughs> you go meet and there. And please, stop rape. If get there, you stop. Stop it. <laughs> Say no to rape. Free rape is here. Holy Ghost. Fire. Say no to rape. If get there, you stop. Stop. But try to differentiate between the meaning of stop and stop, Joe. Ah. For Calabar, they told say Calabar girls, they too like men. Now be on our fault. Now this country where all of us day, they say men are dogs. And now since for this country where they say Calabar like dogs. Why won't Calabar girls like men when they see men as dogs? For Calabar, yeah, the way that they take train dog, when they hold your dog, they go first carry the dog, train the dog, pamper the dog, make the dog feel comfortable, come kill the dog, eat the dog. <laughs> now the same way, Calabar girl go hold your man. When he first hold your man, I go bona if Calabar girl hold you, they go take you, pamper you, train you. Make you feel comfortable. When you finish, they you and they eat you. Master Seb. Master Seb. Uh, they know if you want me now. <laughs> Master Seb. Boss. There's nothing I will say here that I haven't said before. But there's one thing you did today in a final performance that stands out in all your performance. I believe that every time you have an audience, do well to pass a key message. Do well. Because apart from this crowd watching you, people at home are watching you. And the most interesting part of your comedy today, which is not a joke, when a woman says, stop. Stop. But like you explained it to... There's a difference between stop and stop now. <laughs> but at the same time, it's not that deep. Stop jaw and stop is still stop. Stop. <laughs> I don't do well. <laughs> Okay. The same guess, so they try to defend oh, 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 oh. Because if you get money and they say stop jaw, you still go to. Hey. But I said stop jaw. They go arrest you. I'm so you. stop. Make she come by herself say I was just joking. joking. Yeah. Master Seb. I found her. Are they alright, ma? I you feel. Are they alright? If I'm to stop talking, just say stop, alright? Alright. So your performance today was not all that. I didn't like it. You know, go talk stop. Okay, any two way to my stop, my shall stop. Okay. <laughs> what do you know, like? It was not nice. Stop, Joe. Ah! It was the worst. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> my sister, like I say, you are one original comedian I've met and I've seen, and man, you're too much, guy. Like, you're too <laughs> much. You understand? And I always look forward to how, I don't know what next you're going to do. Like today, you came in a wedding girl. Then the next night, you see the way you show up. Like, you are amazing. I, you don't have this crowd because they know you or whatever. You have them because you're good at what you do. Do you understand? Whatever happens tonight, guy, you, you too, you're too sure. You're too sure. Just hold down one. You're too sure. Not in, you. not in the pa. You understand? Ah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that situation right there just explains everything I was going to say about you. Your ability to take every single situation and turn it into a comedic moment is unbelievable. Well done. 
and I do wish you all the best. The competition tonight is steep, it's tough, but you know, say you be winner. But you go like, if you like that money, Abby. <laughs> say stop, Joe. I'm not going, no, no stop. <laughs> but wait, wait. Is there any time you're ever serious? Like your serious self? Yeah. You're not serious now, come on. <laughs> I'm a serious person always. Where? Yeah, I'm a serious person. Master Seb. Yeah, yeah, man. <laughs> Thank you very much. My bride is making me very happy tonight. Stop, John. <laughs> no, goodness, goodness. Your own talents now follow come. Now follow come. You, you know, I don't think you learn it or you prepare it or whatever. I think you just open your mouth and oh, it comes. So it's like you have an anointed mouth to make people laugh. See, you know, I am more excited about your, the, who you would be or what, where your destiny, what your destiny is or how you take your craft to the next level. I'm more excited about that than you even winning tonight. Because what is out there is way bigger than all of this tonight. This is just a platform. It's what you do with this that I am more excited about. I just, I would be so heartbroken if you do not jump in on what you have created from this platform. I don't care if you win or if you do not win because the competition is extremely tricky at this moment. I don't believe that none of us here knows who's going to leave here as a winner tonight. We don't know. I can tell, tell you that for a fact. But wh whatever happens, my point is, just don't go back home and wait for another five, seven years to start manifesting your glory. Seize the moment. This is your time. Seize it. The industry is ready for you. Run with it. Thank you. And make me a proud groom. Thank you. Thank you, man. You just spoke to me. <laughs> Speak out, my brother. <laughs> mm. As I said, um, you're going to be great. Thank you, Rose. But I don't know if this your characterization is just for this show. Don't end it there. Okay, boss. This characterization that you bring in for every performance should be a key part of your act yeah. moving forward in your career. This is your last performance on this stage as um, on this season. But I really want you to take this characterization as your own thing. Take it as your identity. Your originality should be something that should never leave you and your characterization. These two things will take you to a place that so many comedians are, their leg never even touched there. Just hold on to these two things that I said to you, and when you get to that place, you go remember, say, I talk them. Yeah. As was written by the prophet, a savior will be born. Who will wash away the sins of men? A virgin will conceive by the Holy Ghost, and the government shall rest on him. Oh, I, I, now no matter how they try to stop him. They will never stop the prophecy before him For he is Emmanuel Forever God, God is with him Doing wonders, doing miracles everywhere Was my Savior's work here on earth If you believe you, you will receive And you will know that Yes, she died
he died you don't need to die yes he paid the debt you could never pay all you need is just to believe because he died you don't need to die yes he paid the debt you could never pay all you need is just to believe yes he died for you difficult outstanding performance range depth everything you came on stage to administer to us and that you did but while administering you fought two battles and the crown is deserved to you as much as so many people here deserve the crown Yuji you are a winner <laughs> wow, I'm just sick. I swear I'm not. <laughs> you do royalty, you are one of the most. No, I'm not crying tonight. You are one of the most consistent performers or talent in this competition. Week in, week out, week in, week out. I think we all can, when we go to sleep, I'm sure we can hear your voice, like you're that familiar in our heads right now because you're sounding like somebody that we hear literally every day on the, uh, on the radio, you know? So, uh, <laughs> wow, girl, I don't know. I, I was hoping you would make it easier, but I don't know. If you win, if you do not win, you, you already know who you are. But, girl, you are amazing. That's all I can say. I don't know what else to say. Well done. Great job. Great job. Um, I, I think we've said a lot of things about you over this, this competition that are consistent with saying that your vocal range, your talent, you know, your performance, you know, I, I was, was expecting something different, you know, for your final performance. Not being said, that was a great performance. I was just, you know, expecting something different. That was a great performance. Um, I, I'm, I'm going to go out on a risk here and just say that I personally prepare, prefer your voice when you don't shout. I know that's what gets everybody hyped, but you have such a, an amazing voice when you don't scream. Or I'm not screaming, it's singing, but you know, I'd love to hear more of that.
something about this competition right it is very easy to lose your spot and it is also very hard but still very easy to take that spot you guys started this competition not as the strongest but you're ending it as the strongest like I would say this to you Anybody that wants to vex you carry me to his zoo, no Allah. You guys are phenomenal. And it's all that as well that the dance is. All that I've done before. It's good though, but you cannot compare it to this newfound version of yourselves that you brought in the last three performances. Keep this side of you up. Guys, you guys don't know what goes on behind the scenes. You know what I mean? The fight, the, the, so each and every one of us here, everybody is here just looking for the best talent. So every day, every time you guys come out here, you make it difficult for us to decide who goes, who stays, who stays and who goes. Every time we have decided to capture you guys in this competition, for all the time somebody has fought for you guys to still be in this competition, to this particular performance, you made it worth it. And right now, I want to believe that none of us regrets the decision to keep you guys in this competition with this performance. If you, had done, if you didn't do this performance, I'm sure we would have probably been beating ourselves up. But you guys have given us, you've made us to believe that there's a reason why we were called to sit on this panel as your judges with this performance. So thank you for making this performance tonight. Thank you. Thank you. My, my spirit, I will sleep easy tonight. Whether you win it or not, I'm just happy yes. 
that you guys did what you did tonight. Yes. Now my mind can rest. Yes. Thank you. I, I have no words. I think that performance was everything. As somebody who started out as a dancer and a backup dancer, to see you guys do this, unbelievable. The beginning, the sync, the ending was everything. And I think everybody in this hall, each other can be no joke. <laughs> see, I don't, I don't know where to start from. First thing first, that performance was, I didn't see it coming. Do you understand? I didn't see it coming. As a dancer, yeah, you guys are doing the dance industry proud. I will give it to you. That was an amazing idea. I don't know who brought it up. The execution was flawless. That's a typical winning performance. It's not easy. I've been a backup dancer for so long. You have to dance behind someone to get that crowd yelling. But you guys did this on this stage without any artists in front of you. You did that yourself. Whatever happened tonight, I want you to take this with you. This is just the starting point for you guys. Whatever happened, don't let it make you feel like, yeah, if you win, don't be too proud. If you don't win, don't feel less of yourself. It's just the starting point, okay? Something somewhere is waiting for you. Someone's waiting for you. Win or lose tonight, you guys are winners. And take that with you. Take it to the bank. Take my people with me. Together we are going to a brand new home. Far across the river, can you hear freedom calling? Calling me to answer, gonna keep on keeping on. And I know what's around the bend might be hard to fast cause I'm alone. And I just might fail, but God knows I try. Sure. Take my people with me Together we are going To a brand new home Far across the river Oh
try after try It's getting harder to see the light Night after night You cry yourself to sleep Praying for changes Waiting for your moment to come And when it's close All you gotta do is take a step Oh, hold your feet You know it only takes a moment To change your story Make a move You're getting closer Leaving all your doubts behind you Hold on to your dreams and believe Let go of the pain you felt yesterday Cause it's holding you down And yes, it's holding you back No matter what comes your way Nothing will ever change The greatness in you Hold your feet Change your story, make a move. You're getting closer, leaving all your doubts behind you. Hold on to your dreams and believe. Oh, believe, yeah. Oh, believe, yeah. Oh, believe. So, honestly, I expected you to perform at least one of the songs from last year before you give us your own original material, which I absolutely love. But I've never felt prouder to be part of someone's growth and success than watching you right now mature with a smile, with total control over your vocals. Yes. An amazing performance. Thank you so and a true much. testament to what this competition can put out as a winner. Well done. Thank well you. done. Lika Rose, first time seeing her perform? Yeah, this is my first time. You know, I've seen like the finalists from last year perform and I keep asking um, C and I'm like, I, I want to see the winner. Because what else? Like these guys did great. And I've seen you today. Your so your voice is something else. It's so soothing to the ear. I'm like, where's that coming from? Like you Thank you you, you I don't know what to say. That was amazing. Well done. Thank you so much. Wait, 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 yes. wait. And I thought, I, okay, so I got it wrong. I didn't, oh my gosh. I didn't, I didn't get it. I thought you guys. <laughs> That's an original, right? I'm yeah. um, the first one. Yes. The no, first one original. was an original. No, the second one. The second, second one. This last one is an original. Yes. Sir. This is the one I'm asking is an original. Yes, sir. <laughs> Baby girl, you're doing the tang, tang, tang. You're singing, you're singing that song. Well done. You look Thank so beautiful. You. It's you. so great to see you again. You. I hope life has been treating you fairly. Yes. And I hope that you don't let that fire go off. You need to keep that flame burning. Thank you. Thank you. We hope to see you doing greater things in life. Absolutely. I can. Well done. All I can say is I am super duper licious, duper little rocious, proud of you. Thank you. You are making us proud, and I can't wait to see you on bigger stage. That's right. Ladies and gentlemen, one more time, give it up for Constance, winner from last season. Welcome back to the show. This is the Night Jazz Spirit Talent Horn Season 2 Grand Finale. The top five contestants are on standby, and in my hands are the final results. Now, remember, this result is solely based on 60% votes from you, the viewers, via the DTH app, and 40% from the judges, all accumulated from the final performances that just happened on this stage. For the last time, ladies and gentlemen, please give it up for your top five. Delta All-Stars, King Sax, Master Seb, Huge Royalty, and I Be Quake. As they all come out. Yes, please come on now, put your hands together for them. They've been exceptional all season long. This is the final moment. In fifth place is... Please make some noise for Delta All-Stars! 
in fifth position. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. You were spectacular. In fourth place, in fourth place, ladies and gentlemen, is King Sax in fourth place. This, uh, this is why the votes are very important. Very, very important. King Sax, thank you so much. Please take a bow, King Sax. It's been pretty good. Ladies and gentlemen, here's your top three. First, you need to understand that all three of them are winning something, right? They're winning something. But the prize money for the overall winner is $7 million. However, in third place... Is... Stand by after the break. Welcome back to the show. On stage with us are the top three contestants for this season of the Niger Spirit. A poet, a singer, and a comedian. In third place, winning two million naira in cool cash is Master Seb! There you go. Come on, make some noise for Master Seb. Come on now. Two million, well done. Head on now. And now this is your top two. Get closer. Yuji, to the side. You can hold hands, it's fine. I will announce the winner, and that means automatically the second person is your first runner-up. The winner of the Niger Spirit Talent Hunt Season 2 is UG Royalty! <laughs> and on that note, we call it a wrap. Thank you so much for watching this being the Niger Spirit Talent Hunt Season 2. I am VJ Adams. It's been an honor to play the role of your host. Thank you so much, all sponsors. Join us on social media, across all platforms. We will see you next season. Good night, everybody! You're the best, number one and nothing less. Lead me to my destiny. Yes. Your top three on stage with Delta All-Stars. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much. It's been an honor all season long. Stand up, stand up for the champions, for the champions. The winners and your judges, everybody. We will see you next season. Follow the Night Test Spirit across social media platforms. So when we announce Call for auditions, you would know. Thank you, everybody. Good night.